as a mompreneur, there will never be time. You must make the time. Time is your most valuable resource and your most scarce resource as well. Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Yesenia. I go by Yes to Fitness. I'm a certified personal trainer. I am a mompreneur. I want to talk about being a mompreneur. And today's video is specifically about time management, learning to work through those micro moments, those 15 minute to 30 minute time gaps that you have during the day, where you can be utilizing your time instead of wasting your time. We're gonna talk about how to feel successful in your business and as a mother. This happened to me many, many, many times. Your child goes down for a nap. You think to yourself, yes, I have a moment to breathe. I have some time to focus on whatever it is I may wanna focus on. So what do you do? Sit down at the couch, maybe grab another cup of coffee and you just find yourself scrolling through social media. You're kind of just wasting time because you're not quite sure how long your child is going to nap. I have been there and I'm sure you can nod your head in agreement that you have been there too. Your child wakes up from their nap. They're ready for their afternoon activities, their afternoon snack. And you feel frustrated, frantic, scatterbrained, unsuccessful, unmotivated, because you had those 30 minutes to work on productivity. You had those 30 minutes to schedule posts for your social media, to get back to clients. You had 30 minutes to work on tomorrow's plans, but instead you chose to waste time I'm going to teach you how to be successful in your day, how to set the tone in your mornings, how to utilize those 15 to 30 micro moments so you can feel successful each and every day and thrive as a mompreneur. Here are my top three tips on time management. Number one, setting the tone for the day in the morning. Know what you want to accomplish and let that be your focal point. Number two, competing priorities and structure. As I mentioned in my previous video, there is always going to be competing priorities. So we must structure that throughout our days. So after setting the tone in the morning, getting done what you want to get done, if you have an additional 20, 30 minutes, why not get yourself in a short workout? I have short and sweet workouts right here on my YouTube along with my Instagram, which I will post down below. Get in some form of movement. It will not only help decrease stress, it's going to help you get into a great mindset. And number three, adapting without the unnecessary stress. Now, as I mentioned again in my previous videos, there's always going to be things that happen. Maybe your little one spilled milk and now you have to clean it up. Don't cry over spilled milk. Adapt and adjust. Clean up the mess, it has to be done, and get back into what you were focused on. Don't let that sabotage you from getting back to your mompreneur duties along with being in the moment. You will be surprised at what you can achieve in those 15 to 30 minute micro moments. When we aren't acknowledging how valuable our time is throughout the day, we're going to feel unfulfilled in our business. We're going to feel unfulfilled as a parent. <laughs> so get back to doing what you love in business. Get back to being present with your child. Set the tone each morning. You got this. Little by little, you can and will feel successful as a mompreneur. You got this. Let's hear it. Yes to success.